What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Playing With Plastic. I'm the Big Cat. Hello. And in today's video, we're going to look at the ultimate Bride of Frankenstein from NECA. We're going to get in close for details. So, very good likeness to the Bride of Frankenstein. NECA kills it. For this price point, uh, I think they're the best around. Best in the biz. Yeah, their figures are slightly more expensive, but for what you pay for a Marvel Legend these days, or even a McFarlane DC Multiverse, I mean, totally different characters and this and that, but for what they give you, I got no complaints there. Always great accessories, but we're not talking about accessories right now. We are still looking at the details, and very great likeness to... Elsa Lanchester, who portrayed the Bride of Frankenstein in the film, The Bride of Frankenstein. Very nice. Face sculpt is great. You got the little dimple in the chin there. Turn the head, you have the scars from the surgery. Very nice. And the hair, iconic hair, it's molded in and then they put the white stripe, so. It's just amazing. Full on Kramer, Marge, they all owe it to the Bride of Frankenstein, you know? Very nice. Let's work our way down. Almost like a mummy figure. It's all wrapped up. Really nice sculpting. Uh oh. Will I get cancelled? I mean, I have to show it. It's not graphic at all. Just like a mummy. There we go. Sorry. I'm really sorry. I did not feel comfortable doing that. <laughs> As weird as it may sound, or be, it is just a toy, but look at that, down to the feet. The only thing, NECA, come on, man, put the freaking, put the, put the hole, put the hole so I can use a stand. But she stands great, by the way, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, let's zoom out. Nice dress, very long. I mean, I wish it had wires, but I wish everything had wires in it. And I understand the constraints for budgetary reasons. But, but, budgetary reasons. You know, you can't put wires in it, but she's gorgeous. Gorgeous. Accessory-wise, she comes with two other heads. When she first comes out off the table, that's the head... The mummy head and the shrieking Bride of Frankenstein head. It's getting close. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. And it is not the same hair. Hair is different on each head. This one is slightly more egg-like and this one's like a brush you know like a beard brush putting on that shave and cream that's what it reminds me of come on brad stand up i don't know why i'm changing accents but uh power to me <laughs> very nicely done she also has this head sculpt also has the scars Awesome, awesome stuff. Oh, and oh, it's getting tricky. There. Flap comes off. Almost looks like Dark Man. Big resemblance to Dark Man. Wouldn't that be awesome? Guys, let me know in the comments. NECA doing a Dark Man figure, Ultimate Dark Man. 
Hell, maybe they did already, I don't know. But that would be great. This just uh, clicks in. There we go. Let's put those to the side where they were. Also, bandages that can be placed around her wrists so she has stuff hanging down. We have freeze hands, or it wasn't me hands, and a karate chop hand for each side, left and right karate chop hands. So I like the uh, what the system they use to change the heads. Just pop it off, and it's like a little bust. You get the neck with it, a little hole there. You just pop the other one in. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. All right, articulation. May as well do it right the fuck away. Oh, no offense to toys and stuff, but I don't like doing articulation in these videos. All right, let's get in here on. The Bride. Head is on a ball and can go quite the ways down and up. I mean, that's neutral. That's up. There we go. Uh, the side. All good stuff. Back out, shoulders to there. You can do a full 360. You should do a good robot. We don't have a bicep cut, which is disappointing, but whatever. It's not like she really needs it. Um, single jointed elbow, get a bit more than 90, wrist, up, down, twist around, you know what I mean? Same on the other side, because why not? Um, you do have an ab crunch, she likes to keep shit tight. Got her. Can't really tell. You're not really going to have her crunching and stuff, so crunch like that. A whole lot of back. And there is no waist swivel. Doesn't really matter because the uh, diaphragm cut works for that. Uh, kick out to there. Uh, knee bend like that. Back, not too much. I feel it uh, resisting. Uh, what else? Foot down like that. Do -do -do. Foot down like that. Up like that. A whole lot. And ankle rockage. Now we'll get into some comparisons. We have her, of course, next to... Her boyfriend, the man himself, the monster, the man, the monster, the legend, looks more like Herman Munster right here, I like it, very good, I like that, ultimate Dracula, color version, next up, got the ultimate wolfman, Lon Chaney. Junior? It's just Lon Chaney, I think. Pain in the ass figure. Looks amazing, but uh, standing him up. Plah. You know, just because I got the horror stuff out. Horror. Next two. A werewolf. From 
American Werewolf in London. A Godzilla figure from Godzilla vs. Uh, Biolante. All right. Next to a Mezco 112 Collective, Destro, hint, hint, upcoming review. Just because next to a Marvel Select, Beta Ray, Beta Ray Bill. Beta Ray Bill. Yeah, there you go. Big boy. All right. Final thoughts for The Ultimate Bride of Frankenstein. Uh, I give it a strong recommend. Uh, I Do I wish it had maybe a bit more accessories? Sure, why not? But uh, it's not even a negative that what they gave is sufficient enough for what you pay for. Uh, you get an extra set of hands, you get the bandages that fall down, uh, and two head sculpts. So for me, a solid release. If you're collecting the Universal Studios uh, figures from NECA, then you're going to buy this anyways. Uh, whether it be in black and white version or color. So, highly recommend it. If I was to give it a number score, I'd give it uh, 4 out of 5. Solid stuff from NECA. And that's it for this video. Please don't be shy. Leave comments. Let's start some conversation, and uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you haven't already done, please like and subscribe, it helps a ton. And I'll catch you guys next time. Big cat out.